Marilyn Manson knew nothing about Pal's rape allegations against his guitarist October 22, 2017 625 p.m. Est Marilyn Manson is saddened by the rape allegations made against his longtime guitarist Twiggy Ramirez by an ex-girlfriend. Jessica Adams of the band Jack Off Jill dated the guitarist, who also performs with Nine Inch Nails, in the 1990s, but in a lengthy Facebook post on Friday, she accused the musician of subjecting her to physical and psychological abuse during their relationship. Adams claims Ramirez, real name Jordy White, beat her and once slashed her car's tires after she gave a male friend a ride home. Recalling her alleged rape ordeal, she wrote, He forced me onto the floor with his hand around my neck. I said no. I said no. I said it so loud enough that my friend Pete came rushing in from the other room to get him off me. But I had been raped. I had been raped by somebody I thought I loved. That night I slept in Pete's bed and cried myself to sleep. Neither of us discussed it until years later as we both had our own shame about not reporting it to police. Adams also alleges White punched her in the chest several times following a night out with Nine Inch Nails leader Trent Reznor, and was warned not to talk about her alleged rape ordeal by her band's record company. However, she revealed she has chosen to come forward with her story now to show solidarity with women who have come forward over the past few weeks with stories of their abusers in various industries following the sex scandal surrounding disgraced movie mogul Harvey Weinstein, whose reported bad behavior was exposed in the New York Times and New Yorker articles earlier this month. White has yet to comment on his EXS allegations, but Manson has since addressed the controversy, insisting he was unaware of the abuse Adams is said to have endured, reports BrooklynVagan.com. I knew Jessica and Jordy had a romantic relationship many years ago and I considered and still consider Jessica to be a friend, he shares in a statement. I knew nothing about these allegations until very recently and I'm saddened by Jessica's obvious distress.